I'm glad you decided to do the multiple choice practice today. These questions are going to go with the reading that we just did, the tournament in the previous section of this Google form. These multiple choice practice questions look really similar to the ones that are going to be on your checkpoint, so I'm super excited that we have a chance to go over them together. I'm going to start by reading the question and answers to you, giving you 10 seconds to decide your response. If that's not enough time, you can always pause the video and then hit play when you're ready. We'll go through why some of the answers are wrong, and eventually we'll go over the correct answer together. So let's get started. Question number one. Which statement best explains why Henry is uneasy about the upcoming tournament? A. He is worried that he will be severely injured. B. He is worried that his reputation will be ruined if he loses. C. He is reluctant to take on more responsibilities if he wins. D. He is reluctant to fight against his best friends. Let's start with an answer that we can eliminate first. I know that B isn't the right answer because the te text mentions Henry's excitement at making a name for itself, but it never mentions that he feels fearful or he's worried he's gonna ruin his reputation. So I know that this answer is incorrect. There's actually another answer I can eliminate. C, the text does not mention any extra responsibilities that come with winning the tournament. It only mentions like prizes and rewards. So I know that C is incorrect. That leaves us with A or D. So if you picked B or C and you need to change your answer, you have five seconds to do so. All right, are you ready for it? The best answer is D. The main conflict of the story is that Henry does not want to harm Gavin and Cedric. So it makes sense that he's mostly uneasy about the tournament because he's reluctant to fight against his best friends. Nice work. Let's try out another question. Question number two, which sentence from the text best supports the answer to question one. A, quote, that in turn led to the possibility of joining the upper nobility, owning land and gaining power and prestige, paragraph two. B, quote, but the thought of hurting his best friends was unfathomable, paragraph seven. C, quote, within the castle where Henry lived, all the knights thought of nothing but the upcoming tournament as they ate and slept. Paragraph one. D, quote, knights could be, and often were, killed at these events. Paragraph six. All right, are you ready to eliminate some answers? Remember, we're looking for a quote that shows that Henry was reluctant to fight against his best friends. Well, let's start with one we know we can eliminate. I know that I can eliminate A. A is what Henry thought at first, that the possibility of joining the upper nobility and owning land and gaining power and prestige was really appealing to him. But once he thought about harming his friends, he no longer cared about any of these things. So we can eliminate A. We can also eliminate D. Although this answer seems correct at first because it talks about the dangers of jousting, there's actually a better answer choice that explains exactly why Henry is reluctant. That leaves us with B or C. So if you need to change your answer because you chose A or D, I'm gonna give you five seconds to do so. Are you ready for it? 
The best answer here is, of course, B. This answer clearly shows that Henry is reluctant to joust because he doesn't want to hurt his friends. And that's what we were trying to prove in question number one. So the best answer here is B. Awesome. Now that you've had a chance to practice process of elimination, why don't you try a couple questions on your own? Let's take a look at question number three. Gavin and Cedric eventually agree with Henry, but they do not take his side at first. Which of the following statements describes Gavin's and Cedric's initial points of view? Remember, initial means first. A. The boys believe that knights should serve a lord. B. The boys feel they have worked too hard to give up. C. The boys fear that Henry wants to trick them into quitting. D. The boys value their friendship with each other more than with Henry. All right, Kipsters, are you ready for it? The best answer here that shows Gavin and Cedric's initial points of view is B. The boys feel that they have worked too hard to give up, which makes them hesitant to follow Henry at first. Are you ready for the last question? Question four. Which statement best reflects the theme or central idea of the text? A. Friendship is more important than wealth or fame. B. Adventure and rejection are a part of life. C. Determination helps one achieve dreams. D. Independence is more important than brotherhood. All right, Kipster, did you pick one that reflects a universal theme or moral? Did you pick an answer that explains some type of lesson that a character learned after overcoming a conflict in the story? Could you find evidence in the story to defend your answer? If you answered yes to all of the above, then you probably picked A. Friendship is more important than wealth or fame. Nice work. You've now completed yet another task to earn you five points towards your grade in reading class. One more activity after this. See you there.